Hey guys, it's Kath. Welcome back to my channel. It is officially festival season, so I wanted to play around with some festival Coachella inspired hairstyles for our naturally curly hair. And honestly, this is the first time I did this style, but I really love how it came out. So I used some of my favorite products from the Main Choice 4 collection for this style. And honestly, it's what I based my entire look off of. Purple makeup, purple nails, purple hair products, purple everything. <laughs> so before we get into the video, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I post videos about beauty, fashion, family, DIY home decor, and a whole lot of Jesus. So make sure you're staying tuned and press the little bell button next to the subscribe button so you're notified whenever I post a new video and you don't miss a beat. All right, guys, now let's get into these curls. All right, we're starting off with some tired, worn out curls that have been in a bun for longer than I want to admit. <laughs> and we're gonna get right into these main choice goodies. Like I said, this is their core collection, which specifically focuses on healthy hair growth and length retention. It's infused with biotin, nutrients, vitamins, and botanicals, and it's gentle enough for daily use. So I went ahead and wet my hair, and I'm gonna wash with a detangling hydration shampoo, which is just gonna gently wash away impurities in any product buildup. Once I rinse out the shampoo, I'm gonna take the deep strengthening and restorative mask treatment and generously apply this all over my hair. I love this mask so much. I find that the longer I leave it in my hair, the softer and stronger my hair looks and feels. I try to use it at least once a week or every two weeks, but if I don't use it, I'll just go ahead and use the conditioner. So I'm just gonna take my hair section by section, spraying water and applying that mask, making sure that every strand of hair gets some love and detangling while I do. It's really important, guys, that your hair is very wet when detangling to avoid breakage. And of course, we should already know this, but in case you don't, when detangling, always start at the ends of your hair, slowly and in small sections, working your way up. So I like to put on a plastic cap and then put my satin bonnet on top. This is just going to help lock in that body heat to warm up the mask and give us better results. And I like to leave it in for an hour and then rinse it out. Now I'm going to use the 3-in-1 Revitalize and Refresh as a leave-in conditioner. No matter what style I'm doing, I always have to use a leave-in because my hair is so dry that it's the only way my hair is going to hold onto that moisture. So I'm just gonna apply this all over and brushing it through to make sure my hair is fully coated. Then I'm gonna take the biotin infused styling gel and in sections, I'm gonna brush it through. I wanna set aside the part of my hair that I'm gonna braid, so I'm just separating a portion here and gonna slip it back for now, and then continue applying the gel section by section and getting the rest of our curls juicy and ready. The key to getting really bouncy ringlet curls is to brush at an angle like this, shaking the curls a little and then scratching them up like so. This will help get them all in formation. Now for the styling, I'm just gonna make four vertical rows here and just keeping them separated with an elastic. I'm taking the edge control and brushing back any baby hairs and flyaways and now with each row I'm separating them in the middle and basically making two squares and securing them with a rubber band. And I'm just going to repeat that step through three of the sections. Now I'm just gonna braid a small portion of the bottom section and then bring that up, securing it to the top section with an elastic, if that makes sense. <laughs> it's pretty easy. Now with the hair that's remaining, you're gonna pretty much French braid those together and bring it back to the last remaining section of your hair. This was honestly kind of hard for me to do because I couldn't see the back of my head. So if you have a friend or someone to help, then girl, get some help because I was stressed. <laughs> now I'm just gonna diffuse my hair until it's 100% dry and that took me maybe an hour. Fluff, pick, and separate the curls until I'm happy with the volume. I got a bunch of these hair accessories from Amazon, which I'll link below, and I'm just gonna dress up our little braid here. I think this is what really brings the whole look together. And of 
course, we need to lay down them baby hairs and then fluff a little more, add some finishing touches, and then we are done. love this look as much as I did if you did and you want to see more videos like this make sure you comment down below and let me know and make sure you guys head to your local Target or stores near you to check out this core collection from the main choice and honestly any of their collections because their products are so bomb and last but not least if you're interested in this makeup tutorial right here I'm gonna link that down below in the description box and also I'm just gonna put it right here so it's easy for you just Click right there, you know you want to, to support your girl and go take a look at this makeup tutorial that I had a lot of fun making for you guys as well. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and all that jazz. I love you guys so much, but more importantly, Jesus loves you like crazy. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video. Be blessed.